YouTubers out there, how are you doing? I'm doing pretty good. Um, I, uh, today it's Saturday and uh, this is the weekend vlog for you guys. <clears throat> Nothing much really happening this weekend. Um, I'm not too sure what's in the gig guide this weekend for whatever's on tonight. Um, I have no idea. I should really check that out and see if there's anything interesting for... I don't know, for me to go out and do, maybe play somewhere, but I doubt it, because my, at the moment, most of where I play it is at MoGo, and that's only every once a month, pardon me, um, we are, me and James will be doing some busking this year, but um, we have to put our forms in to busk, um, and we've already, um, We've already uh, got a few places where we can go and busk as well. Outside of um, Planet Planet Tex, which is um, a music shop in Maria and Texas Dave, um, he's he's um, he actually wanted me to go and play out the front of his um, store once a couple of couple of times before, so. Um, his uh, wish will come true. Uh, it will be me and James. <coughs> <coughs> and at the Maria Markets as well. And at the Maria Markets we get 50 bucks. Um, plus tips. So that's pretty good. I don't know if we get 50 bucks each. But, um. Like, but, yeah. So, um. Maybe it's 50 bucks. And then... $25 each and then, yeah, tips or whatever, that's fine, I don't care about that, that's, that's fine, um, so, uh, yeah, uh, okay, what was I looking for, oh yeah, fuck off fly, <coughs> videos, um, the last gig guide, which was this one, I'm not actually going to listen to it. I just want to read what it says here. What is on? What is the date today? It's the 23rd. Nothing. Uh, there is some stuff on, but there's nothing that I... Well, I mean, there is one that I would like to go to, but it's just... It's out in Maria. I just can't get there. Uh, I can't get back home. Um, it's just too far out. Uh, for me, um, but that looks like a really good gig, um, if you want to go and check out what I'm talking about, um, go check out the, the last gen, it's the January gig guide for, uh, from the 22nd, 24th, what? Oh, yeah, from the 22nd to the 24th of 2016, um, so the weekend, there's really not much on, and, I'd love to go to this um, Friday community jam night out at um, at the River Rock Cafe in Bermagui, but um, still Bermagui is too far out for me to go, so I can't get back and blah blah blah. Um, anyway, go back to my normal channel. So um, the last couple of days I've been talk well, not talking, but. Um, this person's been commenting on um, my channel um, and commenting about because um, uh, well what why aren't you going in um, this person how what the hell it's snapped off no way this this pen just snapped off I don't know I don't even know when it did that what the freaking hell? Anyway, so, um, I, he, he tells me he's, well, I'm guessing he's got Kleinfelder Syndrome, but he doesn't look like he has Kleinfelder Syndrome, uh, um, unless he's been on medication since he was, since he was, uh, younger, <coughs> um, <coughs> And he's and and that's that's the reason he looks 
like his age or whatever because I went to his YouTube channel just yesterday just to check out some videos of his um, nothing really that interests me so I didn't watch a lot of them and but um I uh what the hell sorry oh no just look I was like there's someone on the in the middle park somewhere anyway um so he's 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 been saying you know stuff that he had oh so the living with Kleinfelder syndrome vlog um I pretty much all I'm reading there is um what is written in a document on uh, an official Kleinfelder syndrome site um and like I say to uh, in the vlog that all KS men are different they all have different symptoms some have more some have less some have the same but I and for me mine are the less symptoms um, but there are symptoms that um, we are finding out uh, that that aren't even written in the, the 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 documents of the official web pages, and um, this is a reason why I have told the. Uh, I don't think it was this person. I think it might have been another person that was commenting, but uh, I said to them, if you if you have concerns about <coughs> um about uh, uh, other people with Kleinfelder syndrome and and um, and uh, would like to make a statement make a YouTube channel I will support your YouTube you, YouTube channel I will um, I'll get other Kleinfelders to join your YouTube channel so to subscribe I will <coughs> shout it out in the um, I think he did make it I think it's called the chaos army um, which is a great name for it, um, but the thing is, um, uh, you just, you need to make some content for that, and also if you want me to make some content, I will make some content for it as well, um, and upload it, uh, like, to the channel as well, if you give other people rights to upload anything about the Kleinfelder syndrome uh, to try and get the awareness awareness out there of of what the the disease uh, syndrome is about. So the thing is, right? So he's telling me that he has ticks, facial ticks. I don't have any facial ticks. Um, he says that I do, but I actually don't. Uh, a tick is where someone's always doing like this. That's a tick. I don't have that. I have an itchy face and I'm either doing this, you know, or my nose is, there's always a booger up in my nose and I'm trying to move it without picking my nose on camera, you know. Um, so, yeah, and... Most of the other time is because my beard is itchy and I'm like trying to scratch it. But, um, no, um, I don't have any ticks. That, that's, uh, that's just, that's just me. Like, um, uh, it's, and the thing is, um, this is another thing, like, um, I'm Kleinfelter with osteoporosis which is the starting off of osteoporosis so there's two um, there's two uh, main um, oh and depression and there's three main um, factors in my in my medical history or whatever right so um, I think ticks are more ticks are more from people who have um, Oh, what's it called? Um, oh, my 
my friend has it. Um, Tourette's. Uh, Tics is uh, something that mostly Tourette's syndrome has. So you could be Kleinfelder syndrome and Tourette, a little like a little bit of Tourette's. Um, see, my friend has a really mild form of Tourette's. Um, she doesn't do the the, the, the the vocal Tourette's. She has like this uh, tick that in her leg, you know, or in her in her body, and she just and when she when she gets anxious and and very um, yeah, anx the anxious part of it comes out, and she 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 moves like you know like this, but there's no verbal and anything in it. Um, so um, yeah. And he said something about a shortened lifespan. Now that's bullshit too. So, so the thing is, no, there are, Kleinfelders um, are usually prone to have something else in with the Kleinfelders as well. It's Kleinfelders slash something else. It's always Kleinfelders slash something else. So, um, you might, if you have ticks, you might be Kleinfelders slash Tourette syndrome. <coughs> um, you know, uh, Kleinfelder slash schizophrenia, uh, Kleinfelder slash bi bipolar. You know, it, there's always you know, and I am I am uh, Kleinfelder slash depression plus uh, osteopenia. So that, yeah. So that's that's that. Um, and like I've been saying a lot, is Klein, all Kleinfelder men are different, and 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 also what I've been saying is we need to make sure that um, Kleinfelder is uh, and all forms of Klein, or, or forms of uh, chromosomal um, chromosomal I don't know if it's a fucking word, but uh, chromosome um, are checked at birth. Um, because it's so uh, common for a, a doctor to go, oh, it's a boy. Oh, wait, no, that's a girl. Oh, wait, that's a boy girl. So, and that's another thing, um, hermaphrodite. Okay, so um, uh, someone was saying, and I can't remember who it was, uh, in the, um, on the YouTube channel, that they have ovaries and and uh, female uh, female breast tissue. I have a bit of breast tissue, but it's really not that much. It looks just like a normal guy who has pecs. Um, so I have pecs. <laughs> um, um, but uh, here, uh, so that, that's that's Kleinfelder syndrome uh, slash uh, hermaphrodite. Um, which is a hermaphrodite means you have both gen, uh, both genitalia. Um, so uh, I met I didn't meet this person, but I uh, came across a person that had triple X, and she was a female, but uh, and and very uh, and I and I and I explained this in my um, in my vlog about the extra X in my chromosomes, how it, it, in, in the, in the, the document that I was reading, the X is, it said in the document that it's a dumb, it's a dumb, it's not very smart, it's a dumb, um, chromosome, um, <clears throat> so, that's where I, that's when I did the joke was, all women are dumb, um, because they've got two X's, uh, now I've got two X's, so, um, this girl had three, so, and she wasn't very smart, um, she, uh, yeah, it was, it was quite, um, it was quite, uh, I was talking to her on the phone, and, and it was, um, really hard to com converse with her, because, um, it this the conversation was like me me like her me 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 it's all about her and um I, I she asked me if I had 
a disability? And I said, yeah, I've got um, Kleinfelder syndrome, that's XXY. And she goes, oh, I've got that too. I'm like, no, you don't. You can't have XXY. You can't have 40, 47 XXY. Females can't have 47 XXY. And she's like, yeah, I've got it. I've got that. That's what I've got. I'm like, no, you don't. See, that's the thing. Um, I had to look up what she had. I said, I said, do you have double YX or do you have triple X? She's like, oh, I have triple X. I'm like, so you don't have what I have because I have XXY. And she's like, oh, okay. So I kind of had to like stop her and go, listen, this is what you've got. Not, you know, but not me, not mine, because you can't have mine. Uh, <clears throat> I think I've had another woman um, say on the channel, uh, on my one of my things, that, <clears throat> that she has XXY. And I'm like, Google, can women have XXY? No, they can't. Uh, so, uh, for that person who, uh, you, uh, either, were either born a male, um, or you were, yeah, it's like, oh, like, I have a friend who lives in America, um, who was born her, her, her she was born a hermaphrodite, and, um, uh, she, uh, as her parents were like, oh, we want a, we want a boy, so, um, she, uh, they, they, they sewed her shut, and, uh, she grew up to be a female, she grew breasts, she grew, you know, hips, you know, she grew uh, the female body, it was wrong for her parents to say to the doctor, so her shut. You know? Um, because they wanted a boy, you know? Even though, in the end, she became a female. Um, but she's now a female with a penis. And not a vagina. And, and she is trying to... Like, she's... I don't know how they go about sewing a baby's vagina or whatever. That's just I don't want to even think about that. It's yeah. yeah, but but like like the reproductive system and stuff. Like you, I don't even know how that works as a child. Like when you're a child. Do you, does a, a female, uh, does a baby female have anything in there? Like, do the uh, 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 ovaries in there already, or are they so small you can't see them, or um, or or they grow within the child or whatever? So, like, could could this girl be? Um, a male, but have a have a penis, but have ovaries on in the on the inside, you know, and have all the female parts on the inside except for this penis. That works. It works. Um, because we're really good friends, and and I haven't seen it, but um, uh, she's talked about it, you know. That you know, it works like a real like a like a male's penis. It would work, you know. It, it ejaculates it. It pees, it does everything that, you know, a normal male, uh, it gets an erection and all that sort of stuff, but, um, she gets that feeling of being a woman, and also that tingle of being a woman down there too, so, you know, what do you, what, what can you do, like, I don't know. I think the other thing was she didn't have testicles. I think they were on the inside of her body. Like, they were... It was pretty much just a dick. I 
can't even imagine what that looks like. <laughs> like, just having the shaft, like, you know. What? <sighs> so, yesterday's Project Cars came out for you guys, so go check that out if you haven't already. Cool game, that is. Uh, I've been playing that, and I've been playing, um, uh, oh, sickest freaking ever, shit ever, dude, uh, it has to come out in March, I have to, that's, that's in March, that's gonna be in March, um, I'll, I'm gonna tell you what it is, uh, it's gonna be Forza 6 on Xbox One, and it's nothing, it's gonna be nothing but Holden cards. Um, uh, yeah, uh, they now have the A9X, or the AX9, Toronto, AX9, or the A9X, uh, well, one of the Toronas, it's got the HQ Monaro, and it's got the VL Turbo, Commodore VL Turbo. I was like, what? Insane. Um, so yeah, Forza 6. That's really cool. Um, I'm going to check. So, uh, off topic, um, we've been, uh, trying to find stuff for the, uh, the the property that we're buying um and that's that's another thing like that i wanted to talk about the suspense of the loan being approved is just killing me because it's like oh my god and like he mark says it's going to be approved but um it's that it's that you know oh my god is it going to be like come on let's just get this approved already and let's go and let's buy this property and let's um, it's going to be an investment property, so, and, um, uh, we are going to make money from it, um, yeah, so that is going to be amazing, so we're going to go up there, uh, in about, okay, so, uh, probably in March, we'll be up there, um, for maybe around about a month, um, so, I'll be sure to have video content for you guys through March that I will pre-record in February. Um, so February is going to be a big, big month for me um, because uh, I have to do interview with um, someone for the YouTube channel um, and you'll get to know what that is all about on... Um, Wednesday, next Wednesday, because the hump show will come out, um, and yeah, so that's that, um, other than that, oh, so much to do, guys, so much to do, so much to go, so much is going on, um, yeah, wow, um, um, what was I talking about? <laughs> Hate that. Oh, that's right. So we're trying to find stuff that we have here at home that we don't use here at home, and and take it to the um the new property and have it up there. So you know, for when we're up there and we're, if we do get bored, we have board games and we have books and there's all sorts of other things that we're going to take up there. Um, that will suit the suit the type of house that is there. It's an, it's an it's not an old house, but it's not a new house. It's um, but the style of the house inside is the kind of we have stuff here that we've collected over the years, or has been either our mums or our grandmothers or. Um, or even our dads or whatever stuff that has been passed down to us um, and is old and is uh, looks 
look who look good in this house. So yeah. Anyway, guys, um, I can't wait. Um, I can't. I seriously can't wait for this because this is going to be fun. We're going to get out, out there and work. Um, I I want to I want to go out there and work. That's what I want to do. Uh, even though you know you know me, I'm always in pain and that. But um, I I have I have my mindset that. Um, you know, I'm, I've been exercising, I can do things that uh, I thought that I couldn't do before, and now my, 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 my mindset has changed, and I'm ready to get out there and do some things that are productive, and um, yeah, I've got some plans in my head that I want to do to this, this new place, so... Yeah, and Mark also is he's a he's an art, he's a bit of an architect. He does he does he he's an architect, but uh, he's uh, he's a town planner. But uh, he didn't actually he's a good he's just to say he's a good planner and he's good he's good at getting things from here to a piece of paper and drawing it all out. So he's done a really good drawing of what the inside part of the house the, the 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 main part and then the 25 acres probably actually it's probably one acre in the that he's got and then the rest is 24 acres so yeah anyway guys uh this is gonna be a long long weekend vlog because i mean uh, i won't see you until Monday shout out. There will be there will be a shout out vlog on Monday, um, and uh, yeah. So stay tuned for the shout out vlog, which will come out Monday. And there's nothing coming out tomorrow. And um, stay tuned for the Wednesday Geek guide and next week Friday gaming, which will be the new VIP um, update for um, Grand Theft Auto Five. Alright, online, thank you for watching, guys. You know what to do. Hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and I'll subscribe back to you. Comment down below, and I'll give you a shout-out in the next vlog. Um, hopefully, I've... Uh, not next vlog, next Monday vlog. Uh, hopefully, I've cleared some stuff up with people that have been asking questions about Kleinfelder Syndrome. Um, and if you think you have Kleinfelder Syndrome, please go to your doctor, your local doctor, and ask if you can get tested for Kleinfelder Syndrome 47XXY. If, if, you know, if you think you have some of the symptoms that we have, then please go and get checked. Don't ask us. Uh, we cannot diagnose you. Only a doctor can diagnose you uh, through blood tests. So, um... Go and do that. If you think you have what we have, please go and check. Because um, it might be, it might not be what we have. So, uh, always please do go check. <coughs> um, I'm getting a lot of young people who are like going, oh, you know, like under, uh, I think the last one was 13, turning 14 or something. And he was like, oh, but I'm scared that I'm never going to have kids. I'm like, dude. You're too, you're young. You're too young to even thinking about thinking about kids. Um, I'm glad that I can't have kids. Um, I'm not saying that I don't like kids. I just am glad I can't have them. Um, because my life would be would be so different if I was able to have kids. I'd probably have thirty million kids out there somewhere. <laughs> Alright guys, take it easy, turn that easy into a slizzy, I'll catch you on the flip side, and I'll smell you later.